everybody. So for maths today, you are going to be doing something a little bit different in that you are going to be finding your work on Google Classroom. Now, this is how you find your quiz for today for maths. You go to the nine dots on the side here where it says Google Apps. You click on that and then you scroll down to Google Classroom, which is this green icon here. You have a click and then you go on to our year one. Um, page and this is our class code for our Google Classroom page it's QBBLP2N okay now at the top here up there <laughs> you go to classwork which is this tab and then you click on week six daily sparkly brain teasers literacy and maths then you look for the day today which is Friday the 15th of May 2020 which says maths quiz you click on it and here is a link to a Google form. This is where you'll be answering your questions today. So there's no need for you to upload any work to Class Dojo portfolios because what this form does is it records your answers and your teachers can then see how you have done with this work. Now this quiz is designed to talk about all the things we've learned this week with halving and quartering and there are problems that you need to answer um, and solve so you have to remember your strategies for halving and quartering to answer the questions so it's a good idea to have your whiteboard and pen ready to draw your thinking draw your answers before you type them into the form so I've got my whiteboard and pen ready and I'm going to have a look at the first question with you. So it says Dan had eight, sorry, Dan had four balls. He lost half of them. How many balls did he lose? So this is a very good question. The first thing you need to do is think, is it asking me to half or quarter? What is it asking me to do? Half, yes, very good. So I hope you remember your strategy. Half is one of two equal parts one whole half dan has four balls four balls now i need to share these four balls between these two halves to work out how many he lost so one two oh, three and four ah so dan had four balls he lost half of them. Oh dear. How many balls did he lose? <gasps> he lost two. So I'm going to back to my form now. On there, I'm going to click my answer two. You need to write the number and not the word for the answers. And then I'm going to click out of it. Enter. And that's it. I've answered that question. Then I'm going to look at the next question says Joe had four balls, he lost a quarter of them. How many balls did he lose? Now you need to think, what is your strategy for finding a quarter? The teachers have been talking to you about this this week. So hopefully you can draw your picture to help you. Now some of the questions you have to write your answer or type your answer, and some of them you need to select the right answer, okay, from like a few options, okay? All the questions need to have one answer for you to submit your form at the end. So it says here, submit. Once you've finished everything, all nine questions, you click submit. And then the teachers will see your work. You will get a score out of nine to show how well you have done. And um, we might go back to you and say, have a look at another um, a question again, um, that kind of thing. But just do your best and see how you get on. The questions get trickier as you move through the form. Good luck, and if you do need any help, go to the TA Help Desk at 11 a.m. and they will help you right along. See you later.